What do pregnant women, alcoholics, and morbidly obese people have in common? They are all at risk for a syndrome that could cause brain damage and memory loss. But as Marty Salt reports, there is a simple solution to help keep them all healthy. Susanna Hessler cooks healthy, eats healthy, even draws healthy. But a year ago, Susanna was near death. It just spiraled out of control. Susanna's been an on-again, off-again alcoholic since she was a teenager. Every time I saw her, it was quite obvious that she'd been drinking. A court order forced her into the hospital. It was there she found out she had Wernicke encephalopathy. Her excessive drinking triggered a syndrome that causes brain damage. The short-term memory was almost non-existent. She, she would finish breakfast and could not tell you afterwards what she ate for breakfast. Wernicke encephalopathy is caused by a lack of thiamine or vitamin B1. Washington University fellow Gregory Day studies what it does to the brain. The first sign would be simply confusion, sleepiness, drowsiness, acting differently. Alcohol stops the absorption of vitamin B, and Dr. Day says that all too often patients are not getting the treatment they need. I was quite surprised just at a local level to find out that much more often than, uh, than we'd like to, our residents, my colleagues, were prescribing a pill when they should have been prescribing an injection. Day's research shows that 42% of patients were only given a thiamine pill, not an injection or IV, putting them at risk of brain damage and memory loss. With high dose intravenous, intravenous therapy that rapidly corrects the level and fixes, fixes what's going on in the brain. Even reverse the damage. Suzanne has been alcohol free for one year. She was first treated with an IV of thiamine and is now on a daily dose of it. Her short term memory is returning. I mean, I almost died. That is a place that I intend to never go back to. I'm Marty Salt reporting.